We've been getting your tax waiting on your unemployment benefits. EDD telling some people they are denied. So I lost all my money. It just it went, it went off my card. My card got frozen. Everything just locked up. Chapone, an event planner, hasn't been able to work and had to file for unemployment. She had to move away to save money, and that's when she said her account got flagged. Chapone is currently in the appeal process. She's currently at this step and hasn't heard back. To best explain what happens in the appeals process, let's go through this flowchart. Once you get a denial letter, you have 30 days to appeal. The appeal must be in writing. You can find the official form on EDD's website. From there, your case goes to the board and someone from the field office sends you a notice of hearing. According to their website, currently all hearings are over the phone. I've not worked in almost a year. So yeah, it's, it's rough, you know, I'm I was supposed to be able to pay my rent this month and I couldn't. We connected her with Daniela Urban, the executive director with the Center for Workers' Rights. She's helped thousands of people through appeals. The general overturn rate is over 50% in favor of the claimant. And then on cases that involve notice of determinations, finding people ineligible for benefits based on identity verification, where they didn't send their documents on time, according to EDD, those are currently being overturned at a 92% rate. Urban also says she's seeing a huge delay in determination notices from EDD during the pandemic. It could be that they need identity verification information, a confirmation of wages, or they're waiting for you to certify for benefits. Um, and so it might actually not be a need for an appeal at all. If you're needing help to navigate through getting your unemployment benefits and the appeals process, the Center for Workers' Rights may be able to help you.